We did not understand how the force of gravity worked before Einstein gave us this Didn't general theory. Yes. But actually, what Newton gave us is a formula that tells us the strength of gravity, but he never told us how gravity actually exerts its pull. He couldn't oh, figure really? it out. Figure oh. So, relativity uh, come out. 1905. 1905. That's yes. his, uh, what did you call, Annus Mirabilis. E equals MC squared was an afterthought of the special theory of relativity. Really? Yes, yes. Like, MC squared. That's right. Yeah. In June of 1905, he publishes special relativity. In September, he has a little extra idea, which is E equals MC squared. Wow, man. Okay, yeah. so this is 10 years later. Yes. But his real focus, the passion of his life's work, was to figure out gravity. Yes. He's deeply puzzled. How does the sun keep the Earth in orbit, right? What is gravity? And he's thinking about this, thinking about this. And one day in 1907, he's in the patent office in Bern, Switzerland. That's where he That's had where a job. Worked. That's yeah. right. And he had <laughs> what he called the happiest thought of his life. So he imagines a man falling from the roof of a house. And he realizes that that man would not feel his own weight. He would feel weightless. Oh, he's in free fall. He's in free fall. He's on a yeah. scale, right? The scale's reading would drop to zero because he's no longer pushing on the scale. He's falling with it. I understand there's an experiment to demonstrate that. Yeah, a little simple demonstration. Let's keep yeah, good. It's very simple, right? So all we have here is a bottle of water that has holes in it, right? So, of course, the water is spraying out of the holes because gravity is pulling on the water, right? right yeah. But if Einstein is right, if I drop this bottle, the water will no longer feel gravity, so the water should stop spraying out. So let's see it. Three, two, one. Whoa.